Having scoured the country, I found just one group who are actually taking this seriously. They're not a legal body, but a housing union in Newcastle called Acorn. I'm joining them as they confront a landlord who is offering a free room in exchange for sex through Craigslist. They're going to meet him in a cafe they've hired privately. Once the decoy has made it clear she's from Acorn, the others will make their presence known. Everyone's just getting into position now in the cafe. Um, they've got different members of the team stationed on different tables. And I think that nerves are quite high and everyone's sort of just getting ready now for the, for the meeting. Um, well, how's it going? Um, I'm Louise Arts. Um, I'm the I've asked them if, as well as observing, I can ask a few questions myself. I just want to introduce myself. My name's Ellie Flynn. I'm from BBC Three. Um, we've been following Acorns. Just to let you know that we're filming. We just want to have a conversation with you. Okay. When the landlord storms out, we follow him and try to calm him down. What I want to know is just like why. Why you've done it and like what it what is. Do you mean why have I done it? What I want is to know your perspective and, and understand why well, you've offered I'm that. After a chat outside, he agrees to come back in and talk to us and said we can film as long as we don't show his face. It's not just about sex. Yeah. It's about companionship. You know what I mean? So. Can you understand though, like, though, if I did come to yours? I would be paying you with the sex for the Oh, shower. yes, uh -huh. The way I say it is, I'm not doing anything wrong. I didn't know it, it was against the law. Right. You know what I mean? So, no, no, no. So... If, if you, now you know that it's against the law, <coughs> you will do it because you don't want to break the law. But not, not in the perception of just asking for sex. I mean, it's already me saying, oh, you come live with me for sex, right? If you turn around and said, oh, no, 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 when you got there, what am I supposed to do about it? What do you think I've done wrong? Apart from asking for sex. It's still, you still did ask for sex in exchange for rent. I know you're saying that you wouldn't have necessarily expected that, but you did ask for it. He might have gone in there thinking, I've got to have somewhere to live, so I've got yeah. to do what he wants. Mm -hmm. That's what's wrong about it. But can you see that that grey area is why this is a problem? Yeah, why? Well, definitely. One thing I wanted to ask is if you think you'll continue to apply that way on Craigslist. I don't know. I can't truthfully answer that. But like I said to you, if she turned around and said, no, fair enough. I'm not going to force myself on a woman. Totally, you're a totally different ball game then. Because then you're getting done for rape. You know what I mean? You can't do that. I felt quite frustrated at times because I felt he didn't really take any responsibility for the fact that he was asking for sex in exchange for somewhere to stay. If Acorn and if I can prove that this is a problem that's happening time and time again, up and down the country, then it's time that the government and the police listen and actually do something about it. 